Hey guys, so I just got back from visiting my friend Richie and uh, I've got like 37 vacuum cleaners on the car so I need to bring them all in, which I will do and I'll put them in the backyard um, and sort them all out um, into what I want to do with them some I'll keep, some I'll do up and sell and then I will talk you through them so, here we go And that's that. I need a drink. Whilst we're here and we've got them all out um, and before I decide where to put them all, let's run through what we've got here. So first up, we have a couple of Electrolux power systems. I bought these because I have the 1740 version. So now I've got these two as well, um, which is the trio, I think. Then I've got this Hitachi, Hitachi Upright. Um, that's not for me. I bought that for my friend Luke. Uh, because we need a motor from one. Hopefully it'll fit his machine. Then we have a red Vortex. Yeah, don't have one of those. A Ramsey Rose Turbo Power. Now I do already have one of these, but the back door on mine is really badly scratched here. So I bought this one from Rick. Um, so I can basically use the back door. And I'll put my back door on this one. It's got a black body, sadly. But never mind. It's good to have the back door. We have 550 which I don't have. That's quite badly faded. It looks worse in the sun than it actually is, but I uh, can probably bring that back. Original Vortex V2000. Need some bits for that. I'll hopefully find them. And an Electrolux SmartVac. So if those other power system machines need any parts, this is the one that will donor those parts to them. And there's the Cyclone cassette for the 1720 and a toolkit for the 345. We go over here, look at the cylinders. We have a compact. That's just a shell, sadly. And I may already have this one, I'm not sure. But we'll see. Uh, Electrolux 380. It doesn't have a motor in it, but I've got a motor upstairs, so that's fine. Then a very rare Electrolux Elite electronic, which is faded quite badly. But again, I think we can probably bring that back. So Hoover Sprint back there. And there's another Sprint there. We should make a, be able to make a good one out of the two. Then we have a Hoover Spirit. Can't remember the last time I saw a Spirit. Um, Electrolux yeah, 185E. That's quite nice. Need some wheels for that. Um, that there is a Hoover Sensotronic System 25, which is very unusual. I don't think I've ever seen another 25, so that's really nice to have. It's basically a System 2, but called 25, oddly. It's weird. Um, Electrolux 350, which I've wanted one for ages. Lovely Electrolux 355. Wanted one of those for ages as well. Isn't it Electrolux 345, which those tools go with? 
Um, I'm not sure what to do with that. I think I, I might keep it, I might sell it, I don't know. I don't know. Um, so now let's move on to the other pile, which is the machines I'm going to re recondition and sell on. So starting here, we have four Wedgwood Green Turbo Powers. I reckon I can make two good ones out of those. I already have a really nice Wedgwood Green, so I don't need them, but uh, they should be able to be refurbished and sold on. Battery, ignore that. U4002 Ranger. That should come up quite nice. I think it will. Then we have the classic Electrolux 302. That should be quite easy to refurbish. They always sell. That's the hose for it, which is a light hose. It's the wrong hose, but uh, I might be able to find a, a better hose. And then we have a Junior Deluxe. They always sell well. Buggers to work on, but uh, yeah, I think we can make that look quite nice. And we have how many? Oh, four 1036 Juniors. Which is quite a lot. That's quite a lot of 1036 Juniors. I don't think I've ever seen so many in the same place. But they should be able to be refurbished. Again, I can reckon I can make two good ones out of these four. Um, Turbo Power Junior, Mark II, back there. Just move that out of the way. Just have a look at that. Again, relatively easy to refurbish. That should sell quite well, I think. Um, DC04 Silver Lime. Just chuck that on Facebook Marketplace when it's done. That's really easy. Get some money back for that. Um, then we have a Mark II 1036 in coffee and brown. Should be relatively easy to do. And then a Junior 1104 out there. So, I mean, these these Juniors are so simple. I've done hundreds of them in my life. Um, they'll they'll yeah, they'll be really simple to to do. Then we have a Auric. They always sell quite well on eBay, so that will get done up and flogged. It's an early one actually, because it's got the power switch on the head. Uh, and then behind that is the Electrolux 612 Electronic. You rarely see these on eBay. So I thought, oh, that's ideal. That's ideal. Unfortunately, I don't think there's any tools. Oh yeah, no, there are. So we've got two tools there, but no flying fanny, sadly. But never mind, that should be all right. People can always find those. And then finally, Bit of a scrappy starlight. I don't know what to do with this really. The body has gone quite a nasty colour, um, but it might come up all right. I've got a spare handle actually. Let me show you over here. Look, I've got a spare handle there, so I can pop that handle on it, and that should be um, should be all right. So there we go. That's the haul. It's a lot of vacuum cleaners. Um, I managed to make them fit into one car, which is good. So yeah. I need to get busy in sorting them out, get some fixed, get them on eBay, get them sold. I'll do a final count up now, now that I can see them all. So there we go. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. T take care.